Alright guys, Mars huge grab and white's completely fine. Everyone Whoa! Guys, it just It's like Elastic Girl, bro. Knows Marth's grab is too damn long. And <laughs> guys, it's not that long. Guys, is it like this in um Ultimate? To anyone that says otherwise is pro I think he's a Falcon main. Gotten away with undeserved grabs is frankly ridiculous. Dang, bro. <laughs> Don't put him in there, man. This is becoming like a Halo Red and Red versus Blue, it's like custom animation. No, it's do it's a documentary style video. We gotta treat it with the you know proper parameters. Everyone knows Marth's grab is too damn long. I mean, it's okay. That. <laughs> Oh my god. In the first minute of this video by Hugh with over 7 million views. Dang, bro. Imagine the revenue. $21,000. How could you not know? Just look at it. It's crazy. Some might even say it's totally like... Look at him grabbing like... Shh. It's like the bully in high school. He grabs your shirt like this. They, they did to me, man, and it hurt. Look. I mean, how else could you explain this, and this, and this? Sure. He's grabbing him by the nose, guys. Man, I wish it really was Game Watch was a stronger character in Melee. But thankfully, we have Ultimate, so I don't gotta worry about none of that. Surely it's some hitbox jank. Perhaps a developer accidentally added a zero to Marth's grab range somewhere. Or maybe <laughs> Marth's grab is erroneously based around the length of his sword. Or maybe Marth takes advantage of a subtle, obscure suction mechanic that slightly moves opponents toward it. We need to take a look at- oh, Wait, that's too far. I don't think he could usually grab from that range, right guys? This hitbox. Once and for all. Huh. More modest than one might have thought. In fact, it's completely reasonable lengthwise, especially when comparing it to some other famously long moves. <laughs> Back air, by the way. It's so modest, in fact, that when I compared Bowser's grab to Marth's years ago, a few people were in disbelief. And someone even accused me of editing it to look smaller. Excuse me. Hmm. Mm. I mean, it does extend a little bit fa longer than, you know. But, but Bowser doesn't. Bowser has a bigger hitbox. Her box than Marth. But I guarantee you, this is it. But if Marth's grab is fine, then how this? And this? And um, this? Hmm. Maybe it's a little bit uh, broken, bro. The fault lies with the opposing party Yoshi and Fox with their snouts, Falco with his beak and everyone else with their own protruding body parts. <laughs> Keep in mind, too, that Marth smartly leans forward when he grabs, increasing his effective range. It's quick animation making it seem- He's just throwing them all away. He's throwing them all over the- he's on, And then he's on to the next, bro. Marth is freaking a champ. Even more ridiculous when he's standing upright afterward. It's also important to realize his fully extended arm is only on screen for one frame, a flash to human vision, making it difficult to notice at all, while also sometimes being obscured by the grabby. Funnily enough, there's something in-game presumably designed to prevent awkward-looking grabs like these from happening, in the form of ungrabbable legs, arms, tails, and fleshy appendages. Apply- Whoa, whoa. And Kirby got some, uh length there it looks like <laughs> rather arbitrarily across the cast guys look at that it's, it looks like an incomplete game <laughs> there's so many little characters we said that in the other video but the sword characters for instance have ungrabbable shins and a single ungrabbable forearm with the exception of young link whose forearms are both ungrabbable Pikachu has rather useless, ungrabbable shins, while Pichu has rather useless, ungrabbable arms. Jigglypuff is just a grabbable circle, with even her hair being given the ungrabbable property. Dang, bro. While Kirby is, fittingly, completely grabbable. Oh man. 
They should have made Kirby's feet at least ungrabbable, bro. That would have been a cool balance thing, right, guys? Finally, the tip of me. That would be cool if they release official balance patches for, like, this game, bro. That would be so awesome. Two's tail is ungrabbable, while everyone else in the cast pretty much just has ungrabbable shins and forearms. Not bad, not bad. Other than Game of Watch, who looks like this. These. Dang, bro, they, they, they always made the nose grabbable, bro. Still grabbable upper arms and legs are the reason most extended limbs can. I mean, I mean look at his beak, bro. <laughs> but grabbing by the beak? He's just like a giant bird. Still extend far enough to be grabbed in ridiculous ways. Which is why clips like this can happen. Oh. What the fuck? <laughs> oh my gosh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Ridiculous. <laughs> that, that's kind of a... That shouldn't have happened. What the fuck? <laughs> what the hell was that? <laughs> Why this property wasn't applied to other things, we can only speculate. Oh, so he did, he did tilt. Cause like, uh, I, occasionally, like, I, I don't know that I'm extending my freaking hurt box. Like, I think I'm sending out like freaking back airs and stuff. And, and they, they like, uh, uh, you know, won't stay my hurt box. And then they either grab me or they, you know, get an attack on me that they otherwise wouldn't. It's like, dang, sad late on but one thing's for sure if the developers didn't want you to grab falco by the beak they definitely could have made it happen so the grab was in the game would be so different at that point away perfectly fine after all well at least in the way people said it wasn't yeah but look at his arms bro it's like a giant rat bro you you ain't got no reach mark got reach less Bowser ain't got no arms either, right guys? ...of a jank issue and more of just a visually unclear issue, due to Mart's outstretched arm only lasting a single frame. You know what is fucked though? Marth's dash grab. All this range talk reminds me of a comment I read while I was researching for my last video. I mean, he does have a chain grab, so... Dio. On one of the most famous grand final sets of all time, a skeptical man accused one of the greatest players ever of cheating. What? No, not M2K, bro. He's, he's so strong at the game. What are you doing, Armada? How is nobody going to bring up what happens at 627? Armada shines him from two characters away. Call me crazy, but that was not legit. And neither is him pulling stitches so often when he's about to lose. Funny how it's only when Armada is about to lose will he just hit you with a shine with- Guys, I used to think of conspiracies like this, but... I just stopped doing that. Twice. I've never been a YouTube commenter, have you guys? Do you guys comment on a lot of YouTube videos? Let me know in the comments below. It's the hitbox. Or pull that stitch. I'm sure I'll get hate. But I think he used an Arduino and would only turn it on when he absolutely had to. Never mind the fact that this match took place in January of 2015, before Dark Wizards were putting even simple devices inside top players' controllers. Let's just talk about limbs. As we've seen, if you attempt to hit something and an opponent grabs your extended limb, it can look pretty crazy. Like yeah, uh, it's, still a it's still an ultimate, guys. Still an ultimate. Likewise, if you attempt to grab something and an opponent uses a ginormous fucking attack, like Fox's shine, it can hit your arm attempting to grab. In fact, with some careful position- Like some freaking scary electricity right there, man. Positioning, we can make this situation look even goofier than it does in this clip. No <laughs> Arduino required. Looking at the match itself, the frame before Martha's hit looks like this. But the available VOD has a skipped frame just before the shine connects, as evidenced by the cent a second counter going from 49 to 46. Sent a second. Oh, snap. Oh, yeah, there is that. Guys, that is not an ultimate. As opposed to 47. 48 does not exist because melee only runs at only 60 FPS. Man, I can't even stream 60 FPS melee, man. Sucks, bro. I just got a new laptop. I can't stream it. This means the actual frame before looked like this. When the visual of Marth being hit is shown, he's really far away. But. Dang, bro. So we couldn't even see. 
this frame, bro, at all, man. What when the heck? foxes shine hit Marth, the game was checking Marth's hurt boxes based on his continuing grab animation, which it. No, the Paper Mario music? Okay, I vibe with it. This frame would have been this, easily within Fox's ginormous shine. As far as pulling that stitch go, he got shot. While it is strange he pulled three of these rare, powerful turnips during his winter set with PPMD, this video by Save is Untitled analyzed all 3,048 of Armada's turnip pulls during his last year of competition and found Armada was actually slightly less lucky than the standard rates. Maybe he hung up the Arduino for that year. Damn, bro, this guy is freaking taking an tournament analysis to a new level, guys. Regardless. Sheesh. You can make a career out of that, like this guy basically is. Every time you see someone fall victim to a grab or get grabbed yourself, realize that every interaction is a two-way street. Whether the grab comes from a long arm, your natural protrusion. And they're not playing in front of a large crowd of people. Protrusions, a limb to grab onto, or any combination of these. He just slightly puts his paw there. He's like, yo, chill. Things. And it probably isn't as insane as it seems if you just slow it down. I'm not going to say it's not bullshit, though. Anyway, here are some truly messed up grabs. Big thank hey, you to the? Alpine, Chenry, Droid, Dubs Rewatcher, Evan M, Fobby, <laughs> Look at his slow grab, man. George Bush, Game Player 1500, Guava with a question mark, Harpo Dog, John B, Cathro. Hey, bro, has a lot of Patreons. Arg, Lenny M, Lonely Rolling Egg, LRC Napkin, Lumap, Matthew B, Ordice, P Jiggles, PM Casey, Safi Chaos, Shep if you tried meditation, that. Is that. I think I watched a video about like how to, how to do that glitch. Back. We're gonna find more glitches in this game for sure. Direct tribe Wyvern and Yashichi. It's broken, guys. Oh my gosh, he's on the moon. He's on the moon. Here, right, guys. Martha simply learned the tool of leaning forward and making, and it made the entire character broken. Didn't expect the he you cameo in 2023. Pretty hard to be in an Asum says. I thought it was Asum Samus, bro. Pretty good as usual. And that's the guy shouting it out. Mars actual grab range and why it looks weird reminds me of how so many people in any fighting game forget you extend your hurt box when you actually. Yeah, we, we mentioned that. This channel is seriously one of the best on the entire website. Rarely do I rewatch it every single upload from a creator. Yeah, I, I've seen every single uh, upload from this guy as well, guys. Cool. You know. He's like uh, a sunny V2 of Melee. He's some sa so his hands down the most detailed Melee creator. Alright guys, that's the video. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys in the next video. Peace out. Please consider um, I got original creator in the description. I'll put his Patreon in the description. Later. Later. Have a good note one, guys.